In today's video, I will tell you how to hide or blur your t-shirt logo in your video. So you are watching a braiding tutorial. Make sure to subscribe my channel for more videos like this. So I have taken this video from here and I have taken the part of this video where this guy Cristiano Cristiano Ronaldo speaking. So I have to blur this logo. Here you can see the Nike logo. So I have to blur it. So how can I do it? First of all, we have to do is make a copy of the same video. Same video. So what we'll do is take a part from this. Uh, we'll take a part from here, a patch, and put it on the Nike logo. So we'll create a duplicate of this video on the above with alt and dragging it above now select the upper video and close the eye of the lower video so go to the opacity panel and click on the box here you can see the opacity box and click on the box so it will crop the video and now whatever you how much patch you want you have to select this so i will take a patch from his t-shirt or anything he is wearing so let's zoom it a little bit let's say 50 now i've taken a t-shirt patch from this and you can see here you can see this here you can see the only patch is remaining on the video slide so now open the <clears throat> now open the video i of the lower layer and here you can see select the first layer and drag it a little little bit down to hide the logo and this it this is it so we'll zoom it a little bit uh, so here you can see i have added the i have added the logo now it's looking a little bit weird so what we'll have to do is what we have to do is we'll make it a little bit blur so we'll go here you can see the mask option and here you can see the mask feeder so increase a little bit so this much and now here is the placement here this side and you have to adjust it as it and the logo in your video to hide it properly I have done this hiding it on the whole video so here you can see it's revealing on the another frame so we'll we'll open the track mask path to track the area of the logo so first we have to select the area now click on the first frame and just click on here toggle animation and just play it and just click on the track selected mask forward so it will autom automatically trace the area with the logo and hide it by your another clip let's play it now it is striking and it will take some time So here you can see the keyframes are creating automatically by tracking itself and here you can see the movements it is tracking Premiere Pro tracking is not uh, as much as effective as uh, After Effects so I will prefer you to do it in After Effects. Here you can see 
the logo has been hided properly so here you can see the logo has been hided without any efforts so that's done guys logo has been hided just uh, take care of the mask feather and the mask mark feather it will definitely give you a good result if you have any doubt or any question please ask me in the comment box and do subscribe my channel for more videos thank you guys